I'm going to be starting off with a blank face, of course, taking my BB cream and my multi-benefit foundation brush and just brushing that all over. This is like a primer and foundation and perfecter all in one. It's seriously called a BB cream four in one um, by Maybelline. A friend actually got this for me and I absolutely loved it and I started buying more and more because I just love it so much. It literally works like a concealer and a foundation only I do still use concealer and foundation. Um, not on a daily basis when I do use this. Um, I do tend to still wear foundation. I'm just going to be rubbing that all over my face and down to my neck and now I'm going to be taking my Maybelline Fit Me foundation stick in the color 240 or in the shade 240 however you want to say it and I'm going to be applying it straight to my face and then taking the same brush I'm going to be rubbing it in basically down to my neck again almost like what I did with the primer and primer I was gonna say primer and foundation but that's like what I'm doing now so basically just doing the same thing Once I'm done, I'm going to be taking my eye base primer because we are going to be applying shadows to give your face a little more awakening. Going straight to my neutral palette, I'm going to be taking the mid um, brownish, I guess you can say beige, and putting that right in the crease of my eyes, not on my lids, not on my brown bone, brow bone, but right to the crease of my eyes going all the way towards the end of my eyebrow or the beginning of my eyebrow, however you want to say it, the inner of my eyebrow, there you go. And I'm going to be doing that with a blender. And the blender that I use is from MAC and it literally does all the work for me so I just have to go back and forth. Um, and the reason why I'm applying it just to the crease is to give your eyes more of an awakening because this, this look is obviously if you're running late for school or work or you just want to go somewhere really quick, it's to just give you that brighter look. And now I'm going to be going back to my palette and getting a smaller brush and picking the white color and putting that all over my eyelid and in the inner corners of my eyes, staying away from the crease as much as possible. palette and taking the darkest shade and going over my crease starting from the outer corner going my working my way in and that's just going to give you more of that awakening again especially if you have brown eyes like me very dark brown eyes it will help you so much Now I'm going straight to filling in my eyebrows and I'm using a eyebrow fill-in, I don't know, it's from MAC and I'm using my MAC gel um, eye sh eyeshadow. It's not an eyeshadow, it's an eyebrow gel, there you go. I lost the word for a second, I didn't know what I was going to say. Now I'm just going to be packing on my powder to set my foundation and all of my makeup along with it. Again, I did use concealer but I did not put it in because, well, I'm kind of dumb and forgot to turn on my camera while I was doing my concealer. So yes, again, if you want to conceal your face, go ahead, go for it, I'm not stopping you. Um, if you have the time, then do it. And now I'm just going to be taking this new mascara that I love, 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 oh my gosh, probably more than the falsies, and it's still from Maybelline, so this is probably my new favorite mascara. And I, it's in 
all black again. I just have to have black mascara. So I'm just going to be applying the first coat, letting that dry. I'm going to be applying my nude lipstick. Again, you want to keep this look a little more on the natural side, or you can just go with a bright pink or dark lips. It doesn't matter, whatever you feel. But again, this is supposed to be kept under 10 minutes. So line your lips, do whatever you want to make them pop more. But I'm going for the neutral look. Now I'm going to be taking a clear gloss and putting that over my lips to kind of make the lipstick stay on a little bit longer because it was a matte kind of lipstick. Now I'm going back and applying more mascara because if you're like me, I have to have my long, long eyelashes. And that was it. Hope you guys enjoyed this quick and easy under 10 minute makeup look.